Yoga Media Girl, and I'm at T. I T Designs. I T Designs with Yulandi. Yeah. Um. Uh. So, what do you do? I'm basically a blogger, and um, what we're here for today is we're at the International Fashion Cell, and we, it's two bloggers. They came together, did a collaboration to do t-shirts called the High Tea Designs. And we do like a few local teas with very nice slogans like Ain't Laurent Without Ease and yeah, a few other more. Cool. Do you make the t-shirts? Yes, so it's all local. It's all local products. Oh, so you like put them together and everything? And we, we even, let me show you, we add our own personal touch to it to make it very unique and it so that everyone can distinguish that it's actually not an ordinary oh, it's actually paint. And they all have an individual painting splatter, so not everyone looks the same. Okay, so anything else? Like, yeah, so what skills do you need to put the shirts together and everything? Basically, I think you need to have the passion for fashion to first of all try to do something out of the ordinary and do something that not everyone is doing, do something that, that's out of the world that everybody would like. Because we all have to keep up with the trend and see what's new and what's in. Because we mean, the younger the generation, the better the clients. And um, like I said, I'm a blogger, so basically it's all about learning your vocab, your comprehension. English is very important. And then, yeah, we just blog about fashion, local, international. And that's about it. And we decided, on, I'm not a fashion designer, I'm a fashion blogger. Oh yeah, I was just about to ask that. Yes. So yes, designing, going into fashion designing might be something I'll be doing, but at this point in time it's not. I just want to play with the market, get something out there, because I want to basically distinguish between an ordinary fashion blogger in South Africa and someone that's taking it to a new, to, to greater heights. Because everyone is doing fashion blogging, but they're not, everyone is not doing a collaboration of t-shirts. And it's also all limited edition. Any tips to somebody who want to be a um, fashion blogger and start um, some kind of clothesline with it? I think to be a fashion blogger you really have to be dedicated because you need to constantly, all day, every day, know all the fashion trends that's happening. You need to actually sit down and actually go do your research because you also don't want to blog what everyone else is blogging. You want to have things in your own perspective and give it a view on what you're doing, you know, within your eye. And then on top of that, you want to, you want everyone to see things through you. Because I mean, what I, my fashion sense and your fashion sense is not the same, but I mean, if you had to read my blog, you could like where I'm coming from, and I could actually like what you're coming from. And uh, I just thought of a question. Um, who decides what's in and what's out and everything? Um, that's up to us to decide, because you know what? We as South Africans, we all, we're very inspired by the Americans, by the celebrities. So we as bloggers have to make sure that we are trained. So we put it out there and they read about it and they go follow the trend. We basically send traitors. Cool. Well, that was Ali. Yulandi. Oh, Yulandi. <laughs> and Go Go Media Girl.